Oh, it is that time, Shams. Look, the Grizzlies, no secret here, they are struggling. And then Marcus Smart gets hurt last week. They did not need that. Uh, what is the latest with him? Three to five weeks for Marcus Smart. He's going to miss time. He's got a foot injury. And so this is a Memphis team, 3-10, and 10, ravaged with injuries all year. John Morant, we know about the 25-game suspension. They're going to be out uh, without him through most of December. And then you have Steven Adams out for the season. Brandon Clark's going to miss a majority of the season with an Achilles tear. And then you have small injuries like Luke Kennard, two weeks sideline. You have Xavier Tillman now is week to week. And now Marcus Smart, this is a guy that they traded for. He's their starting point guard in the absence of John Moran. He was going to start next to John Moran when, when Jaws back in the lineup. But now Smart is out for at least the next month or so. And so, I, you know, for, for the Grizzlies, it's going to be hard staying afloat in this stacked Western Conference um, and and I, I'm just curious from a player perspective how demoralizing this is, injury after injury and setback after setback. Yeah, Chandler, talk about that. How how demoralizing is this? And also, without Jaw and your three and ten, the the concern was the hole would get too deep, then you can't get out of it. Why? Yeah, why? I you? Mean, it's uh, it's brutal for sure. And this is this is a team that would have had very high expectations with Jaw, but. If you look, I mean, the Lakers, they're eight and six. The, the, what? The, so the Grizzlies are four, five games behind getting into the playoffs and not even having to play in the play in. So it is still there for them. I mean, again, what Sean just said with missing Jaw for pretty much a whole nother month, it's, I can't imagine it gets better anytime soon. But, but this is a team without him that needs everybody. They don't have Steven Adams, they don't have Brandon Clark. Now they don't have Marcus Smart. I don't see it getting better this month. So that hole is going to get dug a little bit deeper. Um, but I mean, listen, there's only, they only got to beat out five other teams to get to the play in. And then they're fully loaded with John Morant. They're still, I'm not counting them out just yet. All right. They're cooked. <laughs> <laughs> really? It's it. Yeah, it's bad. I'm, I'm just, I'm, I just wrote it down. I'm sitting here looking. You got OKC, you got the Clips, you got the Lakers, you got the Suns, you got Denver, you got Dallas. Those are teams that are in the Western Conference. So that's another 25, 30 games on your schedule that you got to see these six particular teams. And without your star player out, like you just said, at least for another month, Marcus Smart just going out for a month or so, this is going to be tough for this team to right this ship. I think they're, I think they're in bad shape. They're cursed. This is a this is a disaster, Shams. We appreciate you. We thank you. And we'll see you tomorrow.